Pro-Hamas demonstrations show European nations, including Germany, made a grave mistake, and the continent should be concerned about future hostage-taking raids against its own people if the idea isn't defeated quickly, Henry Kissinger warns. Europe is subject to internal pressure by groups of people of totally different culture and religion because of the grave mistake of admitting too many foreigners. Henry Kissinger said of the phenomenon of demonstrations across Europe in support of Hamas terrorists this week. Speaking to Politico in the wake of the Hamas terrorist attack against Israel on Saturday, longtime kingpin of the globalist movement Henry Kissinger walked back his previous position on the importance of keeping Western nations open to refugee flows and said the events of recent days showed nations had gone too far. He told the publication observing celebrations in German cities in support of Hamas is painful to watch. Kissinger said, it was a grave mistake to let in so many people of totally different culture and religion and concepts, because it creates a pressure group inside each country that does that. Europe should give unconditional political support for Israeli action now the terrorist attack has happened, Kissinger continued, and not least because in his view European states have a vested interest in making sure no precedent is set for raids and mass taking of hostages from Western nations is set. He concluded, Israel must vindicate its sovereignty in that area, and that it cannot permit Gaza to return to a state where it could emerge take thousands or a large number hostage, kill thousands, and then live in that condition side by side with Israel. I would say every European nation has the same interest because the same attitude might erupt in the direction of Europe. While hostage-taking raids on Europe may seem far-fetched, they are not without ample historical precedent and match other warnings about the very high consequence risk of the tactic coming to Europe's shores. Kissinger's comments on the grave mistake and danger presented by mass migration creating alien power structures within Western nations are a considerable shift from his previous positions, which he long acknowledged were influenced by his own experience as a refugee from Nazi Germany going to America in the 1930s. In 2015 Kissinger was a CO signatory of a letter to Congress demanding the borders be kept open to Syrian and Iraqi migrants in the wake of the deadly Paris terror attacks. The letter said to do otherwise would be contrary to our nation's traditions of openness and inclusivity, and would undermine our core objective of combating terrorism, because admitting Muslim migrants is a way to defeat ISIS. It said, categorically refusing to take Muslim migrants only feeds the narrative of ISIS that there is a war between Islam and the West, that Muslims are not welcome in the United States and Europe, and that the ISIS caliphate is their true home. We must make clear that the United States rejects this worldview. Police made multiple arrests in Berlin this past week as protesters took to the streets to cheer the Hamas terrorist attack that is thought to have killed at least 1,300 Israelis on Saturday. Protesters chanted from the river to the sea, Palestine will be free, and despite arrests the groups have returned to celebrate on the streets in Berlin night after night, with a fresh gathering in the diverse, left-leaning neighborhood of Nukeln on Wednesday night. TAS reports hundreds gathered in the district despite a ban on pro-Palestinian rallies ordered by police in Berlin and were met by several hundred police officers, who broke up the crowd leading to some scuffles.